small, I didn't feel the see some running room and be able to stretch your legs a little bit. Felt great. Um, felt better to actually get the victory too. Um, I give praise uh, the old linemen, just um, holding their blocks and um, the receivers holding their blocks an extra second to uh, get me to the second level. And um, that's what we did. And um, they just hope I'll make that guy miss. And that's what I did. And we were successful running the ball today. We talked about it this week, waiting for that breakout game. You finally get that hundred yard rushing game. Um, is it kind of a relief to get that first one out of the way? Yes, it really is. Um, Definitely a relief for them to get that first 100-yard game. But the sky's the limit from now on. We still got a long season to go. And um, like I said, get praise to the old linemen and um, the defense for doing a great job. Only held them three points. You got to shoulder a lot of the load today. Did that help you kind of get into a rhythm? Yeah, it actually did. Um, it got me a rhythm um, more than just coming out like that, but gave me a feel of the defense and how they was flowing so I could um, make my reads and go off my instincts better. But um, yeah, we was um, real successful running the ball. Give praise to the old linemen and receivers blocking. Anthony, what was the emphasis defensively in practice this week, and how would you grade your guys' performance today? Uh, if I had to grade it, I'd say from a personal perspective, I'd say A, because I know this whole week of practice, we just like, our coaches stayed on us about just doing our job, nobody trying to be a hero. And like, if everybody do, like, does our job, then you know, we'll be successful. We'll get them off the field and get the ball back to the offense, because that's our primary, you know, goal. Um, this question is for both of you. How did you think the week of practice and preparation went after coming off that disappointing loss and, and heading into homecoming, but against, um, you know, Austin awesome Peay? Yeah, it was, uh, it, it was a great week of practice, like every day. And, you know, Coach, you know, stayed on us and told us, you know, homecoming is mainly, you know, it's for us, but it's mainly for the fans, you know, the community. But we have a game to play. And so, you know, we can't let the distractions get to us, and we still got to, you know, play a good team game come Saturday. Yeah. We um, did a good job with forgetting the past and um, not dwelling on that loss that we had. And we did um, a great job this week just forgetting about it and um, focusing on the next game plan, which was this week against Austin P. And, from, from the score, we did a great job of that. Is there something missing um, you think? Did you notice? Um, not at all. We just, um, coach just harp on, just cherish every moment and play every play like it's your last because um, you don't know when the whistle's going to stop blowing for you. But I guess I kind of stuck it into our heads and then we kind of picked it up. But like I said, we got a long season. We got a week off. And, um, we get a lot of people that's dinged up um, a lot um, healthier. And we still got a long season to go. And we still um, going on our goals this year. You guys ran 66 plays, which is kind of on the low side for a racer team. Was, did you guys know that it would be maybe a slower pace of play or maybe more on the ground than, than what y'all have been used to? Um, not really. It's just, we just, that's how the game played out today, and we just took it from there. Um, coaches did a great job just calling the plays and then going from what they're doing. But like I said, we was just um, playing the game. It's nothing that we just planned out or anything. Anthony, a lot of you on the defensive side have been banged up throughout the season. How ready are you guys, especially on that side of the ball for a bye week? Oh, uh, yeah. Definitely. Yes, sir. Like, to, you know, rest up, heal up, get the treatment, you know. And we know we got a tough stretch, you know, against four good opponents to end the regular season. You know, we're ready. How, uh, is, it, I mean, is this coming at a perfect time for you guys? Yeah. Yes, sir. Definitely. And talk about your defense holding Austin P without a touchdown. Um, you know, is that, you know, Something you guys can hang your hat on going forward? Yes, man. Like, because, like, you know, we saw on film, like, you know, everybody talking stuff, you know, the record and stuff, but we saw on film that they were a talented offense. And so, you know, we knew we couldn't come out there, you know, half stepping and stuff. We had to play our 